And so it begins. Another day with two and two. Dex, come on, down. Bad night last night because Ted had his vaccinations yesterday and he woke up all through the night uh, for feeding. So, and I've just woken up again. I haven't had much sleep. In you go. Morning, Mr. Bear. Morning, Dexter. Dexter, you need to go out? Come on. See the bit, Dex. Poor old Dex. What's up, Ted? Genuinely, on mornings like this, when I'm just tired, I work out how many hours it is until Angelica's nap time. Even though Angelica is just being good as gold, but um. I just can't wait to get back into bed again and she does have a nap in the morning which is amazing and then I just do everything I possibly can to get the baby to sleep at the same time. Oh, that's nice of you. Angelica is being very very sweet with Ted the baby bringing him his little chew things um, Hello, hello, and yeah, it's lovely, it's lovely, you're giving him, oh, you're taking it away again, okay. It's still only half past eight. Oh, she's getting on top of me. Oh no. <laughs> we have to get on with the relay of getting everybody down the stairs, don't we? That takes us ages. It takes us ages to get down the stairs. That's put Ted in his pram. Because he was screaming bloody murder, weren't you? And now you're happy in your pram. Yeah. Mummy nearly had a nervous breakdown. Angelica is eating crumpets and drinking some juice. Oh, uh. What a treat. How I wonder what you are. <laughs> Hello everybody, since we last spoke, the camera battery died um, and we've all had a little nap. Angelica uh, watched some Peppa Pig while I did some admin and Ted slept from about half past ten to half past one. Are you laughing because of your name? Hmm. And um, Angelica's still asleep and I've managed to have a little nap. And now I need to do a bit more admin and we're gonna start on lunch, aren't we? So it hasn't, oh, by me, hasn't actually been that bad so far. Look at Ted's face. Cheese. <laughs> Cheese. What is Angelica having for her lunch? No! You don't want to show? You've got pita bread and hummus and salad. I'm gonna get tea now. Having little minor tantrums about everything that just isn't according to Angelica's plans today. Uh, I've just eaten some pasta that is two days old, that's been in the fridge, that did have sort of melted mozzarella on top, and now it's sort of congealed melted mozzarella. It was actually surprisingly nice, mainly because I didn't have to cook anything. We've come into the garden to pass some time. It is, what's the time? I've got some massive admin crisis going on today, which is just usual. Um, and so I'm trying to do bits of it in between activities. Um, so I'm having to check my phone a lot. Bee. A bee? Bee. It's okay, there's no bees. So this is where it gets sort of tricky. 
um, we're trying to potty train Angelica at the moment and she's been doing really well. But I just ran and got her the potty because we're outside in the garden. But because I'm feeding Ted, she didn't get on it and just pooed and weed standing up on the grass. And now she's a bit upset about it. So, um, and now he's whinging. So that is the difficulty. It's just not having two of you. It's okay. Mummy will pick it up in a second. I'm expecting a really important phone call, so they'll probably call any second now whilst I am feeding the baby. I've just managed to do bath time. Wasn't on the agenda, but I have to say I'm feeling very pleased with myself. Excuse the um, massive knockers shot and my really attractive bra and fluoro vest top combo. Ted's hungry again for about the 70th time today. Angelica is bringing various clothes from her cupboard and throwing them on the floor. It is 5.45, I've managed to get Ted fed and into bed at a slightly weird time. Um, but it's convenient because now it's Angelica's tea time. It's like a constant relay today. Oh my God. This panettone is literally gonna be the death of me. That's all that's left of it. I just keep on ripping massive chunks of it. You want some cake? You just said no. Don't touch the lens. Don't touch the lens. Don't touch the lens. Don't touch the lens. What's this bubble wrap? We've got the bubble wrap from the bottom of the strawberries. What noise does the bubble wrap make? Pop, 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 pop. Yeah, baby. Oh, it is quarter past six and almost bedtime. I'm feeling pretty proud of myself because I've only had probably about a 20 minute, half an hour nap. And I've just tried to focus on looking after the babies today and not getting bogged down with anything else. Interestingly, I have managed to do quite a lot of really very important sort of admin tasks that I needed to do. They're very pressing and they sort of had to be done today. So I've, I've been really efficient with my time and just sort of doing snatches of bits when I can. Managed to answer a few important phone calls and not cry. So yeah, I've, it was actually a really successful day. And there are only a couple of weeks left of having two under two. So I feel like I'm, what's the matter? I'm just about starting to sort of get on top of things. Here's Mr. Bear coming in for some attention. Mr. Bear. Poor Mr. Bear. Mr. Bear. Do this for a long time. Mr. Bear. Pepper. Pepper. Bear. Bear. It goes on for ages. <laughs> Weird little eye rolls and such. So, I need to write up my thing about having two under two before I forget everything. So I might do that tonight. Um, as you know, if you've watched previous videos, my work night starts at about half past seven on my work day, on days that I don't have the nanny. Um, but now that I have Ted as well and I have to feed him, I sort of just, evenings are just a crazy extension of the daytime basically. Um, but I do have lots to do uh, and I do want to write up that post. So making it sound like a horrible sort of task that I have to do, that's something that's more of an enjoyment. It's not really work. Uh, and I like documenting everything, it's good. Right, let's, let's get you changed and on the way to bed, come on. It's quite literally not any part of this room that isn't inhabited by toys. Time to do some tidying. Come on. 9.30, baby is still awake. I've had my dinner, I forgot to film it because I didn't have my camera downstairs. And then we've been searching for some documentation that we can't find and we have literally turned the house upside down. So that was a fun couple of hours. And um, I started to try and do some work, 
but now the baby needs feeding. Hopefully he's gonna go to sleep now. And then I can do my work, eat a magnum, and um, watch Fargo on the television. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Starting to feel very tired. And uh, like I've had my second wind, I've had my third wind, and now my body's starting to say, look, please go to bed. Um, but I've still got all my stuff to do. So that's nice. Maybe I won't bother. If you see a beauty blog post about lip treats and coffee body scrubs, and it doesn't make any sense because I wrote it tonight. It's half past 11, which is actually way later than I wanted to go to bed. But because Fargo is on channel four, and there's an advert about every 30 seconds, Fargo didn't finish until half past 11. And I've got no work done because the baby fed until so late. So I've got so much to do tomorrow now. But at least I'm not home alone. So I can get things done. So I think I'm going to let this cleanser get to work. Um, and I shall see you in the next video. I hope that you enjoyed that. It's really hard to vlog when you're on your own. It's hard to vlog anyway, but... Um, mainly because you feel like a dickhead. But um, it's even harder when you've got a million and one other things to do. So I hope it wasn't too random. And I shall see you next time.